What's up you beautiful people? Stone here and today we're back in Pokemon Legends RCS playthrough part 20 And here's the gang we're all on top of this peak at the Heights camp I thought this would be a good spot to, to start the episode off So what kind of stuff are we gonna get into today? Uh, we're gonna finish off We're gonna do all the main mission stuff with the plates and the sea legends and since this is a side quest i think i'm gonna try doing the seas legend first and figure that whole thing out wait what's going on here cutscenes shaking tree in the background hello that festival attended by everyone in the clans and galaxy team alike oh it was wonderful being able to spend time with iskin in front of everyone was like a dream come true oh yeah you guys don't have to be secret anymore stone lena uh i'm sorry polina here has Something she wants to discuss with us. That's right, you should also hear this, Irida. It seems something is once again very much amiss on Fire Spit Island. You talking about the Heatran thing? Oh, Fire Spit Island. Oh dear, you seem reluctant to get involved. It's just very hot there. Yeah, she was complaining last time. She is from the cold, dressed like that. My, you speak in such dis... Parag disparage what the heck kind of terms of the seat that my lord Arcanine calls home and to think you call yourself our leader Irida No, no Lena. I don't She's just joshing. Oh stop with that silly old nickname in front of others. Won't you you really not doing the nickname thing still? Gar. I'm sorry. I didn't mean anything by it. It's just an old habit Well, anyway, you heard her Please get to Fire Spit Island so we can resolve this. Truly, please hurry. I might melt out here. I seem concerned, but happy about it. Okay, well, we're gonna do that after we deal with the Manaphy mystery. So I'm back after a lot of time and a lot of homework studying up. And I really like the fact that this is a thing. If you notice, my team swapped around a little bit. There's some members here that are like, why are those on your team? It's because... In order to, to do the puzzle, you need a Mantike, a Weasel, and an Overquill on your team. And then you need to go through this gate. And the reason I know that is because I looked it up, obviously. But there's a book in uh, Pokemon Shining Pearl and Brilliant Diamond. And the one library, and I think it's Canalive City and the Giant Library. There's a book on the Prince of the Sea. And it says it has a fairy tale about these three Pokemon going through a gate. And then you get somewhere. I don't know. I didn't actually look at a video because I didn't want to get spoiled with the visuals. But I was okay with knowing what I needed to do. I just wish there was a way in game for us to figure this out. Wait, let me evolve this while I'm still talking. But yeah, I do wish there was something in game to make this more of a thing. I thought I'd have to go into a cave or go through this during a some point of the day. I decided to, to wake up and sleep. Oh, look, there he is. Dude, these eyebrows on fleek, though. Over Quill. Hello, sir. How are you? And in order to evolve Quillfish into Over Quill, you need to use Barbarage in the strong style 20 times. So, uh, similar to how you have to evolve Stantler into Weird Deer by using, what is it? I think he is Psy Shield Bash in the Agile style. And there he is. And if he's bigger than what you're normally used to seeing, it's because I got me an alpha variant. And everything is alpha. My weasel's alpha. The only thing that's not... I say everything... Wait, I didn't want you to pick up a pop pot. I just wanted you to be out here with the people. Look, he's a huge weasel. He's almost as tall as I am. I don't have an alpha mantike, though. This He's just a regular mantike, but he's still good size. He's a good boy. Now, we just need to go into the water on our boat, even though this is a boat, and go through. Oh, the gate! During the evening, too. You have to do it during the evening. Not night, not day, evening. You heard something that sounded like a cry and a boulder shifting in the distance. What do you mean a boulder shifting? Is it in over here in this cave I tried to go in before the seaside hollow? Let's check that out. I accidentally went to the, the wrong cave, but I saw this picture here. What the heck is all of this, then? I love seeing these all over the place. I just wish I knew how to, uh... Do the thing. Oh, there's a Sneasler on there. That's the first time I've seen the Sneasler picture. It's it's in the direct middle Below the Giratina. Oh, that's a Heatran. Oh, this is awesome. They got oh, that's the first time I've seen Electrode also But we got to go for the actual cave. Hey, this is the right cave the one I pointed to not the first one I went in but the second one Is there 
the boy. Oh, and there's a bunch of Fionns. Three of them? Who have you been waiting with to make all these children? You got all these children? Oh, they all want, oh, they all want to fight, solve the mystery? Wait, so did I solve the mystery and now I have to, like, battle them? Are you good, boys? Oh, no, it's a super battle. Okay, good thing it's just bubbles and they move kind of slow. Do I have... Oh, I only have so many spoiled Africans. Where's the real one? They look similar. Ah, he's right here. I see you. Can I... Can I offer you in another spoiled African? I got rid of your little shield, boy. Can I... Please? No, 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 no. Dodge through... Oh, the, the back ones. The back ones. It's like its own little boss fight. What the heck? I can't... Do I have to regularly fight you with a Pokemon now to get you down? Are you always going to be next to one of your boys? Let's let's try this. Are all your boys going to start ganging in on me? Oh, two of the boys did. Two of the boys. What levels we at? What level? 34, 34. Okay, can I... In this game, I think you can fight... Or, um... What's, uh, what's the words? You can catch a Pokemon... But I will, I think I want to catch one of each, so I will knock out this boy first. No shenaniganery from you. Bye bye, Fion. I only need one, or I need two. So is this, uh, is, is this, like, shiny locked and alpha locked? Or legendaries alpha locked, or can you still get them in the alpha form? You're strong styling, Zed Headbutt? Ow! Oh, I forgot I'm fighting type. Oh no, Omen. Who gave Manaphy freaking that move? I want to I wanna speak to them. I want to speak to them. Stop giving them those moves. Here we are. And who? what are we going for? You should definitely be able to live in ancient power. Or should I Should I go for this buddy first? You, can you live in ancient power? I don't know if you can live in ancient power. Maybe I could just try to catch you? Okay, another jet ball this time. Should be good. Hello. Let's do Oh, oh, big jumps still, big jumps. And we got him! Nice! Now we just gotta focus on the Manaphy. So much better fighting 1v1. 1, er, 1v2 is a slippery slope. I was starting to head down, and I didn't like where I was going. You know what? We're gonna go out into Mantike, and I'm going to heal up my Mirage. Okay, don't take him out. He's drowsy. I hit him with a few... Ancient powers, he might be able to live another one, but I don't know about that. It, I'm not feeling too good about it, so let's just throw me a jet ball and let's get this bad boy in here, this little prince. Oh, the tiny jump means we've got him! Woo -woo! His train is going, we're chugging. We're gonna catch so many legendaries today, get so many plates. Oh, and there's another Fion in here. Wait, report back to Professor Laventon. I will do. Can I catch this little dude? Is he just gonna be here forever? You know what? I'm just gonna leave you here. I'm not gonna I'm not gonna get rid of you. I see you caught our mysterious swimmer. So it was Manaphy all along. It seems Manaphy here is a migratory Pokemon drifting to and fro across the sea since long ago. At least that's what it says in the sea's legend. I had a jolly hard time getting hold of this tome, but it seems it was worth it in the end. Wait, was there a tome of it in his office I could have found? Oh, I should check that next time I go back there. And dude, Comet Shards are worth so much money. Does it tell you here? It does not. But I think these are worth at least like 20 each or 15 each, I'm saying. 15,000? Uh, I'm, cho I'm choking up about it because I can't believe it. So who are we going for next? Who do we got our eyes on? Which one does it say? We're go we'll go in order. So 21 is, yeah, catch Mess Spirit as Elf in Uxie. Let's get on it. Hey, I forgot to do this at the beginning of the episode, but I'm another star up. I, I ranked up. Oh, we only got one more star to get. Ladies and gents, you beautiful people. Hmm, you have made progress. It seems you have earned yourself a star. Yes, I have in DD. Nine stars. Here we are. Looking good. Looking so fresh. Looking so clean. Looking amazing. We're great. With this, you have officially attained the rank of ninth star in the Galaxy Expedition Team. The rewards you earn, yes. And I present you with this. Or these. Ooh, 10 rare candies, 20 grit pebbles. Continue to get it, dedicate yourself to completing the Pokedex if you hope to rise higher in the ranks. Oh, so she just gave me stuff this time. Just things. Things that will eventually run out. Not like recipes. They never run out. They they give me something for the long-lasting journey. We're at Met Spirit's Cave. What do I do? Just literally enter and then we get into a fight? 
I mean, I'm finding out right now. Do we have to fight the uh, the Gudra again? Why am I so ah struck in? Oh, there's the mess spirit. Hello, Kian. Should I have brought like battle items? Should I battle you? Should I go into Dialga? What level are you? Can I can I hit you while you're unaware? Maybe I could have tried to catch her. Oh, 70. Hello, 70. You don't have levitate, and this isn't stab, so I'm gonna try to go for an earth power and see it, see what this does, where this leads us. Oh, we can do that a second time. That'd be great. You, oh my, you have recover. You have flippin' recover. Okay, I'm hitting you with a flash cannon. Is this gonna do like at least half? Don't recover. Uh, did that do a little? Are you just gonna spam recover? Don't be like this. Please don't be like this. Oh, no, it's being like this. Oh, because no duh, it keeps recovering because it goes after I do. I can probably stall its recovers out, but then all I'll have left is Iron Tail and Roar Time. How much is an Iron Tail going to do? Boom. I'll, oh, decent amount more. Oh, Agile style in me. Mystical power? I resist the Mundo that? Okay. Defensive stats raised. Aish. Oh, and then you get to go again because you used it in the agile style. Wait, and then your stats return to normal? That was a we that was all a weird situation. And you can just keep doing that? Oh no, the, the different styles is gonna make her PP go away. I wonder, I've never stalled out of Pokemon's PP in this game. I wonder if this is the battle. And it's this Oh, that was a crit! That was or that wasn't even a crit? No, it's defenses are down. Oh, I can't try to hit it again, otherwise I'll risk knocking it out. What do I catch you in? I gotta I gotta catch you in a gigaton ball. I gotta try to catch all the the gigaton ball is my favorite ball. Let's let's try to get them all in the gigaton ball. And oh big bounce. But well, I didn't want it, yeah. Sometimes you wait. Big bounce doesn't always mean that it's not gonna get caught. I gotta wait for her defenses to return to normal. Okay, now I can smack you with an earth power. Don't crit. I wonder if you do knock out the Pokemon, do you get a chance to like re-fight them? Yeah, you can agile style all day. This might take a while, so let's just get to the part where I catch her. Is this going to be the one? Are you going to do a little bounce or a biggie bounce? Oh, we're big bouncing, but it worked anyway. Hell yeah. It actually, it only took like another minute. So that was all good. Now what do we do? There was another, is there another cutscene? There are two more lake Pokemon left to be caught and caught they shall be. And we're here at Ooxie's place. The game actually crashed on me for the first time ever. It was really weird. Right after I tried to come to this area. So I had to re-catch the Mess Spirit and the, the Manaphy and the Fion. So things are a little bit off, that's why. So can I... Oh, you're already alerted. So we're already fighting. You're the defensive... You're the most defensive out of the bunch. So this might take a minute. Hypnosis. Get out of here with that trash. Now, Iron Tail didn't take out Miss Spirit, so Iron Tail shouldn't take you out. Yeah, Iron Tail didn't even do half mystical power. Dude, I'm avoiding everything. I'm a madman. Do you have Recover? So you have Hypnosis and whatever other move you use. Myth mythical power. Looks like they all know mythical power. Defensive stats were raised, but that don't matter. Is this going to be our quickest legend catch? Go Gigaton Ball! And the second time I caught Mess Spirit, so much easier than the first time. I like hit her once and then threw a ball and it caught her. Oh, Ooxie! Ooxie, he knows! Or they know! I don't know. She? Maybe? Some things? Some things are different? I know, I know even even though a lot of the, 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 um, everybody probably does it, or maybe they don't, but I, I do. I usually give, for some reason, a gender to a legendary, even if it's freaking uh, non whatever sexual what it doesn't have bits or doesn't want to have bits that's your preference there ooksie on to azelf i usually call him a boy so we're gonna get that boy hey boy where you at i'm here now oh there you is same mouth every time i only have one astonished expression that's mouth as wide open as can be get ready i'm ready for the dentist pop there you go azelf Please don't put up a fight more than your other two partners have. Double hit. Oh yeah, you're the most offensive of the bunch. So Iron Tail might do a 
might mollywop you a little bit. Oh, that is that is a hit and a half, basically. So we're gonna throw some balls now. Why do you just get to use mystical fire, mystical psychic attack, whatever move that was, twice in a row? We're going for the gigaton ball. The ball's so heavy you can't get out, you can't resist it. Also, you love the pressure. It's like a weighted blanket. Come on. Oh, little jump. Oh my way. This is getting so easy all of a sudden. Where did it all come from? Who do we talk to now about getting the three? Oh, they gave us the Drake. Wait. Why do the three psychic Pokemon give you the Drago plate? It used to make sense, the plates in the beginning in the game, uh, beginning and middle of the game, because they give you a plate that matched their type, and now it's just like, whatever the frick. Giratina could have gave me this or somebody. Ah, frickity frack, I'm talking back. Based on Kogita's hints, it seems there might be three more plates left for you to find. Which one's next? Let's take a look. The plate of Fire Spit Island is mine. Oh, here we have to go. I thought I had to talk to Polina, but you talk to Polina if you want to rematch the uh, nobles, which I didn't know you could do. That's really cool. Hopefully you get some nice rewards. But we got to go over here for Heatran. Oh, what are you guys doing here? Iskin? Hello, Stone. Thank you for coming so far out of your way. Er, Warden Iskin, wasn't Lena joining us? Oh, oh, yes, about that. Um, it seems that she wanted some time with her lord, so she's asked us to check the Lava Dome Sanctum without her. Isn't she, like, literally 50 feet over to our left? What? The nerve of... She knows I can't stand sweltering places like this. I... I'm sure she meant no ill will. The Warden of the Lord of the Isles is such a kind, gentle soul. Uh, anyway, Stone, shall we go? Might as well get this over with. We shall get this more than over with. We shall get this whole thing in my pocket. I want it. It's very good. Heatran is a unique typing in fire and steel. I was kind of worried I didn't have a poke to try to take this dude on. But uh, there he is and I got Palkia. Palkia, I think, will do the job splendidly. Careful, Stone. Or no, that was careful, Stone. What are all these? Oh, can I pick up rocks? Oh, we're doing it. We're picking up balls of mud. This is going to be an active bow. I should have been paying attention to him. But we're still not paying attention to him. Oh, I'm just running still. I'm running still. These mud balls coming from the ceiling, coming from everywhere. What are we doing? You doing far away attacks now? I'm guessing. I'm guessing far away attacks. Where the frick is my mud ball? Oh, oh, oh. Freaking lava. Lava moving from the ground. Can I just chuck one of these at you? Whoa, we're moving. Get that shield out of here you freaking fire spinning shield wait can i just catch you now can i do this is this gonna be an active capture i should pick up more mud balls while i'm doing this okay no 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 oh i guess we just gotta try again good thing they give you mud balls in this whole thing here 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 can i jump through it oh and that makes it have to do the whole radius spin i should have picked up that mud ball while i had the chance can you oh dodging it this is the perfect chime. No, why did I switch off of those? I'm nervous. Right in your tail. Right in your tailbone. What's it gonna... Oh, little bounce? Hey, we got it. Easy and cool fun battle. Picking up all that mud. You gotta get those weird jammy sticky fingies. Iron plate. Now that makes sense. I like that. Okay. Woo, woo. Heatran on the squad. Phew, at least the heat's let up a bit. With both Arcanine and Heatran spewing flames about on a volcanic island, it certainly does get a bit toasty. Warden Iskin, I have to ask, do you think there was any need at all for me to be here? Uh, well, um, y yes, of course there was. After all, you are the leader of the Pearl Clan, and this trouble cropped up right around the seat of one of your clan's nobles, so... Um, yes, it was surely best for you to come see it, see to it, admirable of you to look after your clan's affairs. Do you really think so? I was wondering if it might not be revenge for all the times I pushed Lena to train her Growlithe harder. The, the, that's surely not the case. Even if Warden Polina may have mentioned something about the need from, uh, tough love. I thought so. To think she was so patient and kind with Growlithe, but when it comes to me... Well, Stone, you did great. We'll, um, just head back, uh, uh back ahead of you, then. 
Like ahead of me. What the heck kind of lingo you spit in there, Iskin? I have no idea what you're saying, but I love you, buddy. We got two more plates to go. Let's go. Mud, mud, mud. In the snow point temple we are. Yeah, I forgot to mention which one we're going after next, but you should know by now. So this one, now we have to go downstairs. This is cool. And we don't have to get the other three Reggies to catch Reggie Gigas in this game. Are the other three Reggies even in this game? And I also feel like the Reggies have been getting lots of love in the games, especially ever since Sword and Shield and the DLCs. Now, well, how do I open this door? There's got to be... I'm floating! I'm a ghost! Oh, no! Put your feet down, boy! Why are you floating like that? Is someone here? Oh, wouldn't have expected to run into you up here, Stone. What are you up to? Why are you here? Wouldn't expect to run into you either, because this is where the Pearl Clan lives. They literally live next door. You're here to try and find the secrets lurking in Snowpoint Temple, aren't you? That's what my clairvoyance told me. You do tend... Uh, wait. You do tend get mixed up... Wait, you do tend... I should be... Like, you do... I, I know I mess up my words all the time, but that is not a proper sentence, I don't think. Unless I'm totally out of my gourd. But you do tend to get mixed up in all kinds of strange goings-on, Stone. This door here, well, they say behind it sleeps a Pokemon so great it could tow around the entirety of the continents that lie to the south. No matter what we do, this door just won't seem to open. Oh. Oh, sh get out of here. Wait, what's happening now? I just talked to it, and now it's like the stone plate, iron plate, and icicle plate you're carrying are reacting to the door. Oh, that's why they can activate it. They just needed the plates. Oh, man, I'm kind of disappointed that there's not another puzzle. Come on, don't be happy. I'm happy, and they're both agape. Why am I not a gape? I'm usually a gape. Gape. Or oh, wait, never, never mind. Uh, that was about to go south extremely fast. You couldn't go south. If There's Pokemon down here? What is all this mischief and mayhem? Gravelers and Glalie circle Pokemon? Got some Bronzongs and Bronzors and more Bronzongs. Get away from me. And then down here. Oh, Adamant already came ahead and Regigigas is just chilling? Hey, my guy, what's up? You and your slow start ass. Wait, he's actually probably broken in this game. There's no abilities. Well, what in time? It's. What in time is that thing? It's colossal. It sure seems to be a Pokemon, but let's see what my clairvoyance has to say. You Do you really believe you have clairvoyance? Yep, definitely a Pokemon. My clairvoyance showed me a vision of it in motion. It's literally moving right now. It's not a lot, but you can tell that it has like a wobble, a weeble wobble to it, but it don't fall down. So what do we do? We're just walking up to it, unlike every other one that just wanted to fight immediately. This one, I actually have to get into a radius though. Zut, zut. So this guy just stayed in here. Who locked you in here? Is that why you're so PSE? He's just probably lonely and hungry and he doesn't know how to express himself anymore because he's been in here for millennia. Is slow to go going. Oh, he still somehow has his slow start ability though? That is weird. How do they implement that without an ability? And Reggie Gigas is huge and he's not even an alpha. I mean, R Dialga is, but could you imagine this boy with freaking yeah, alpha powers? I wish we could find alpha legendaries. Let's see how we can smack this dude. You got a lot of health probably. Let's try an Iron Tail. Let's see if you. Oh, really? I missed my first Iron Tail against the biggest uh, target I could find in this region most likely let's try it again and he can't hit me twice because he's got that giga impact nonsense so that's one iron t wait you shouldn't be able to do that again stop that okay now i get to go twice so i can hit you with an iron tail or i could miss yet again dude i hit freaking mess spirit like four times in a row wait do you have freaking no, he doesn't have pressure. I was like, why is my, my PP feels like it was going down faster than norm. Can I hit you with another move? This is 100 base physical attack. This is special earth power. But your your defenses might be lower. You know what? I'm not risking it. We're just going for the gigaton ball. And if anybody deserves this heavy of a ball, it's you there, big boy. Now get in. Oh, big jump, but... Ah, normally I, I felt good about that, but but I guess not. Oh, we get to try again. Two in a row. You can't resist these balls. Hello? 
Get in. Just stay in there. Just do it. Oh, Bigot. He's, he's got some power in him, but I have his power now. Let's get it going. Boop and boop. Yes, I'm happy. We got one more plate to get, and then who knows what's going to happen. Who knows? Who actually knows? You open the blank plate. Oh, so it's like a normal plate. That one makes sense, too. I like that. I like the decision of Heatran and him. Now that was one solid Pokemon, like a giant born of the very earth. Are you guys, you guys are floating too? What's wrong with this floor? Or is it us? I guess this is just part of your job with the Survey Corps, huh? What kind of Pokemon is the one you just caught? Stone? Hmm? I can't wait to see in the Pokedex when it's done. Yeah, I'm pretty curious to read everything Mr. Professor writes up too. See you, Stone. We should do another chase sometime. That would be fun. I like that. That was interesting. It's at least something to do. The plate of Snowpoint Temple. Now we're on to the last plate, and I didn't read it. So what is the last plate? The last plate is going to be the plate of Prelude Beach, which I don't know what this one could be. So it's a mystery. I totally forgot when I was reading the side quest. I'm like, where the frick is Prelude Beach? And then, like, a good thing the markers are here, because it would take me forever to try to find it. I think I would have remembered eventually, but... Yeah, freaking What's-His-Face did say he was going to be waiting here, but what Pokemon is going to be here that's water from the Sinnoh region? I don't... Nothing's popping up in my brain for some reason. Huh. I am very confused. You're still wearing your armor? For a second, your Pokeballs kind of look like you had a gourd on you. Gourd to drink out of. Prelude Beach, indeed a place of beginning. Now, it is not the time for words. Face me in battle. What? Okay, I guess. Is this how we're going to show the Pokemon? Like, where to go? We're going to show them our enormous battle power. It's going to sense it from miles away and come here and wonder, Oh my gosh, why does he have five Pokemon? That's what I'm wondering. Who's my first Pokemon out in battle? Dialga, good. We're up against a Golem. Okay, look at those, one of these legends. This used to be renowned as Almighty Sinnoh himself, but I've reduced him down to a Pokemon. Uh, Flash Cannon, because your physical attack is high. Our physical defense. Oh my! And this guy's level 65s? Dude, we're just in that range too. That's crazy. Heracross. Oh no, he's going to go for a fighting attack. Ay, 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 agile style though. Yeesh. Okay, we're still alive. His defense down is lowered. He's sort. Whoa, you're getting there, greedy boy. Boy, you're greedy boy. Okay. Um, you're gonna be taken out with a flying type move. Indubitably. So, can we switch out to Mirage and do something about it? Or are we gonna lose our turn? Sometimes I've lost my turn, and sometimes I don't. It's it's super weird. It's super weird. See? I lost my move. But now it should be my turn. Stats will return to normal. Let's go. Air Slash. Should I heavy? No. We're no heavy power. It's four times weak anyway. Go for it. Ba -ba 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 -ba. Goodbye. Be gone, thought. And wait. Heracross is faster than Yan Mega? Maybe that's just why I was so lucky. I was just throwing in fast Pokemon. So, oh, you're going to Air Slash me back. Mm, yes, nice. Wow, way to be. Taking out my pokes. Goodbye. Yawn Mega Mirage. So wait, you're flying psychic. I could give you that that old crunch, and you're not gonna be able to really say anything about it. So let's give it to you. Let's give you that. Ooh, wait, rock slide. Rock slide? Yeah, rock wait, rock slide. Yeah, rock slide. I don't know why I just had to like I was like talking to myself in rock slide language. Just say rock slide enough, eventually. Your brain will figure out the rest. Let's go. Boom. Rock slide into Crunch. Maybe a Crunch would have taken him out, but I don't know. Crunch doesn't get that stab. Is there stab in this game? Who knows? Snorlax, here you are. What am I going to do now? I don't know, but oh, I think I'm Dunsky. I'm not Dunsky. Um, he's going to high horsepower again. Almost all my Pokemon are weak to that, except for Usaluna, Omen. Omen can take that. Omen can I switch you out and then you also go? Is that a thing we can do? And then triple arrows him? I almost said Axel, Axel again, but we're going triple arrows. Let's go. Mama, mama Bubushki. Nice. And then it's going to lower your defense, so this next one's going to take you out unless you do something crazy. Okay, just a Zen headbutt. Nice. Okay. Another triple arrow. Let's go. This battle actually hasn't been that bad. I mean, I, we did lose Mirage. 
but not for long. This isn't no lock right now. I wouldn't mind locking this game, but the idea of having to catch on to go around, it's a little bit, like, this game is incredibly fun, but I feel like it's incredibly fun, like, the first time you play. It's like, like it's so new, but I feel like if I had to do this again, it would, uh, it would be a little monotonous. Maybe I'll just take a break, and then I'll come back and do a nose lock sometime. Um, but enough of that future talk. Wait, Crocker, he's the fairy slayer. That's how, this is how he got his name. From critically iron tail hitting someone's clefable. I think this was the clefable he took out. Can we go for a strong? I think we could go for a strong. We're going for a strong because it doesn't look like it changes the turn order. And we hit him! Is it taking him out? It is because I am level 74. Crocker is a huge level. Crocker, why are you so high level? I just noticed. You're redonkulous, my boy. And that's that. Even frightful creatures like Pokemon can become powerful allies. Yes. I do respect his team. His, he, is, he is a cool team. Very diverse. Mostly Kanto. You've grown even stronger since we face one another on Mount Coronet. It's clear you do not view Pokemon as dangerous enemies, but rather as trustworthy allies. Allies with whom you can reach great heights. Perhaps you are a divine being yourself, sent to bring us gifts from above. Here, you should have this. Are you just going to give me the last plate? Oh, the fist plate. Okay. Wow. Oh, yeah, because the last legendary Pokemon was escaping me. Is it because there wasn't one? It was just a fight for the fist plate? I kind of agree with that one. That one's kind of cool. It's a lot better than the freaking Lake Trio one. When the very first of our Galaxy Expedition team, myself, Benny, and the others set foot on Prelude Beach, we found that plate. It clearly held some kind of power, and so I've kept it safe all this time. I find it fitting that it should now end up with you. Who likewise arrived here on this same beach. I like the little subtle detail of me putting it in my pocket and not just holding it the whole time he's talking to me. That's cool. I like that. I like it a lot. Perhaps something is guiding us. Indeed, it must be so. You and I, Adamant, Irida. It appear we're all being guided by the one called Almighty Sinnoh. Hmm. It might be more appropriate to call this region the Sinnoh region. Oh, is this how it gets its name? But if it's called the Sui... You don't think everybody else is going to get upset by this? And where does the word Sinnoh come from? Like, why Almighty Sinnoh? Is that, uh, maybe it has some, some meaning behind it? I know I have no right to say this, but we are truly fortunate to have been able to count you among the Survey Corps ranks. If you had not joined us, we would have fallen on Mount Coronet. We would have lost our home. We would have lost our future. Now then. Carry on with your survey work. The knowledge that you collect about the wild Pokemon of this region will serve to illuminate our path forward as we walk into the future. Well, this guy really knows how to put on a speech in a different lingo of speech because this isn't actually how he talks. When he was scared earlier, that's how we knew how he really talks. We gathered all the plates and we can head back to Kogita. Oh, uh, yeah. Kogita. We're getting to Kogita, but... I think I'm going to leave this on off here. I did a lot of stuff. I got to do a little bit of off-screen grinding to get back that Manaphy and Fion, but it's all good. It's all good in the neighborhood. Let's just take out... Who are, who are we trusting? I haven't, I haven't seen Regal in a second. Here we are with my boy in the daytime. We got all the plates, and we're going to find out what all the plates do in the next part. But before we actually do that, because that might be the end, that might be Arceus, I'm going to... There was a whole bunch of side quests that popped up here and in different places around the map, actually. So I'm going to do all those first. And then hopefully that doesn't take too long. And if it doesn't, we'll do the Arceus one next. If not, I just know that the Arceus one is going to be like the pinnacle episode. It's going to be like, bam, there it is. I'm saving the best for last. That's my style. That's what I like to do with what we're doing. So I do hope you enjoyed. I know I sure did. And if you did, remember these three things. You're beautiful. I appreciate you. And have a great one. Uh, bye bye